from the University of California at Davis. This is News Watch. Passengers may be able to carry their liquids onto an airplane again thanks to technology originally developed at UC Davis. Four years ago, chemist Matt Augustine built a machine to scan bottles of wine for spoilage without opening them. Using magnetic resonance, he could determine the chemical composition of any fluid. Shortly after that, Homeland Security came knocking on his door. Never in my wildest dreams did this ever cross my mind that we would be doing Homeland Security work. The technology is similar to the magnetic resonance imaging machines used in medical screening. As a scientist, if I honestly ask, what types of techniques can look inside of a sealed container? Be it glass, plastic, or metal, an aluminum can. And the only way that you're gonna look inside of an aluminum can, typically, is if you have a low frequency uh, electromagnetic wave. We just take our sample, we put it down into here, inside of this magnet, and um, also inside the magnet, there's a radio frequency coil. We bathe the sample in radio waves, and after 15, 20 seconds, we hope that we're going to be able to detect threat liquids. Homeland Security has taken the UC Davis patent and awarded a contract to a defense firm to develop the scanner further. Augustine thinks that within a year, scanners will be available for testing at airports. Paul Fotenauer reporting from UC Davis. For more information, please log on to broadcast.ucdavis.edu.